Greetings. It is a hazy Thursday and we're here in the yard working. I uh, actually got a lot of work done the last couple of days. Started making the frames, the um, trusses, whatever you want to call it, for the roof of the enclosure so that we can finally get some work done when the weather's not cooperating like it has been late, like it hasn't been lately. Um, had a lot of rain. And it's summertime, so you get those <clears throat> week, not weekend, but like afternoon rainstorms that come through and, you know, throws a monkey wrench into your plans of working in the afternoon when the sun's less high in the sky. So, got to get that on. So, we got those built. So, I'm going to be inviting several friends over with ladders and nail guns to get that up. So, did that yesterday. And today, we have run all of the dug fur through the um, table saw, so it's all dimensionally the same. Uh, it's supposed to be nine and a quarter, but now we've taken an eighth of an inch off of each one so that we can get rid of that radius on the end, and now we are ready to start laying up. So here, uh, if you can see right here, is gonna be the first actual scarf joint that we're gonna glue together. What I did is, the bottom of the boat, um, we're going to start building the Kilson from the bottom up. Um, and the reason that is because some of these boards still have a natural curve in them. They still have a natural belly. And the natural belly, I'm going to utilize it to be the bottom of the boat. If it gets out of spec, I'll plane it down with my hand planer. But we're going to do that way. So anyway, we've laid out the first member. And it goes from tw frame 12 back to frame 29. So it's approximately 27 feet, three inches in length, because we measured it using the, um, the tape, the 100 foot tape. And so here I have laid out two, three pieces of dug fur. And we're gonna, the scarf joints are already cut and we're gonna start gluing them together. And so we're gonna start at the bottom work our way up to the top, building each piece as we go along to make sure it's the right dimension. We don't want to waste any wood at all. So I figure we'll do it this way and um, finally actually do some boat building instead of prepping to build a boat. So that's what we're doing today on a Thursday, not a Saturday, as we build a boat. Until next time, peace and blessings.